The welcome mat has been rolled out as thousands of students head to class over at the University of Texas. Close to 9,000 new students are expected to join the campus this year. Many of them eager to see what UT has to offer. Our Alicia Inns joins us live just outside the campus with a look at the changes ahead for this year. Good morning. Hey, good morning, Kate. Yeah, I've actually been watching some cars start to pile into the parking lot behind me. Traffic starting to pick up as well for back to school. But yes, new year, new changes. Um, one of those being a new president, Greg Fenves. He's actually been a part of the UT system for several years now, but this is his freshman year, so to speak, as the school's president. And during last night's gathering on campus, a tradition called Gone to Texas, we actually talked with the president about the upcoming school year. Um, and as it begins, he's really faced with some controversial issues, such as the removal of the Jefferson Davis statue, which currently right now is on hold. And then there's also changes this year, like alcohol being sold for the first time ever at football games. But, you know, despite these changes, even the challenges here, the faculty and staff, they really do have some big goals for the year. What I would like to see more of is students engaged in addressing tough questions and tough problems. Go out there and take a risk in an area that you're not familiar with, and that may result in failure, and learning from failure is a good thing. Now, there is a lot of events going on during this Welcome Back week. We understand tonight is the Horns Up Night, a kickoff rally at DKR Stadium. Tonight at 545, there's a barbecue. You can take a picture on the field if you're an incoming freshman right now with the president. A lot going on to take part in. I know some students very excited and eager to get back to school. Reporting outside the UT campus, Alicia Inns, KXAN News.